I've known Art when he was a kid practically. He and I were residents together at UCSF. Now, I had just come from learning about something new in cancer called chemotherapy. And the two of us started Children's Cancer UCSF in 1953-54. Then, let's talk about the children. They, they were sick children. They needed a place to go. So Art Ablin and I, but mostly Art, decided to start something new called Family House at UCSF. I first became involved with Family House about 30 years ago. It had just started. I just think it's a wonderful cause. Art, congratulations on this joyful and important milestone in your life. When I arrived as a young nurse in graduate school at UCSF, little did I know I would be so fortunate to have such an outstanding teacher to mentor me as I forged my nursing career. That was the best job in the world. It really was. The families were phenomenal. The team was so cohesive and supportive. You know, to be able to be supportive of those parents, you have to support each other. When I first arrived at UCSF 34 years ago, Art was already a legend. It's his understanding that to be a great doctor, you needed more than just the technical expertise, more than the ability to make right decisions for the patient, but you needed the, from the heart, uh, the need to wrap around the patient and their family and give them support in often their darkest time. Art has been in my life since I was a teenager. I started working at Family House when I was 15 years old and I loved for all these years I worked alongside with Art at UCSF and he never gave up no matter what position he was in. So I was diagnosed with acute lymphoblastic leukemia at age 13. Uh, this was in 1988. He was always telling about all the new research that's going on in oncology and he was always totally up to speed on all that and he'd share it and sit down and talk with me and my mom and my dad about that. When I came to UCSF, he um, had started the Survivor of Childhood Cancer Program and he essentially gave me this gift basket and said, take what I've developed and, and run with it. And I've tried my best to do that and, and we've built a very strong survivor program uh, for kids who have had to endure cancer therapy. So as a mentor, he's shown me how to care. He's shown me how to listen. He's shown me how to be respectful. He's shown me how to give. His first dream was to establish that first family house that I can't remember if it just had six or eight families uh, that was right across the street from the Parnassus uh, parking lot there. The real <laughs> topper was to raise the money for the new family house here at Mission Bay. I mean, his mind is sharper than ever and his determination, I mean, to get that money was just incredible. I actually met my wife of now 20 years uh, at Family House uh, volunteering. So Family House will always have this really, really special place. So 30 years ago, when I was 22 years old, fresh out of college, Family House was the place I wanted to volunteer. And heading it up was Art and Debbie Ablin. And now, 30 years later, I'm happy to say that Family House is embedded in my heart. Every time I see Art Ablin, I get a big hug and a big kiss. He started Family House with that warmth and it continues to this day. When people arrive at Family House, they probably come in the doors realizing they have an incredible, difficult journey ahead of themselves and realize that they're not alone. I've known Art and Debbie um, beginning in 80, 1983. My fir the first visit, my son and I were there and, and my husband. Um, I, every time Art recognized me with all the hundreds and thousands of people he's known. Always very, very warm. There's just no one as special as both Art and Debbie. First of all, Art is the heart and soul of this organization. Not only is he a doctor who helps working on curing the illness, he wants to treat the whole family uh, in a holistic way and make sure that the family remains as a unit and can help uh, support each other. Family House has been a big part of our lives. It has been a lifesaver, literally a lifesaver. Um, I w had the opportunity of staying there when I was a baby with my parents, and then 
We also had the opportunity to stay in there when we had our daughter Brianna when she went through chemotherapy and treatment at Family House. Art, you have made a difference in more lives than anybody I could imagine. I mean, let's face it, who's done more for our families than Art has? So Art, on behalf of everybody at Family House, who in reality is your extended family, chief among them is me, thank you so much. This is the best thing I've ever been involved in in my life. You can't do anything better than this. Happy birthday, Art! Happy birthday, Art! Happy birthday, Dr. Avalon! Happy birthday, Art! Happy birthday, Art! Happy birthday, Dr. Avalon! You need to write down your recipe for life because we all need to take that into account every day. Happy birthday, Art! Happy birthday, Art! Enjoy your 90th birthday! Happy 35th anniversary, Family House, and happy 90th, Art! Happy birthday, Family House. Happy birthday, Dr. Ablin. Happy birthday, Art, and many more. Happy birthday, Dr. Ablin. Happy birthday, Dr. Ablin, and I thank you so much for the vision you had in 1981 to do these for families. Happy birthday, Art. You have seen this through to the end. Happy, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, and thank, thank you, you so, so much, much, Dr. Ablin. Thank you, Dr. Ablin, for the Family House. Happy birthday, Art! Happy birthday, Art! Thank you, Family House, for everything you do, for being here, and for helping those who need it. A happy birthday and many, many more years of success and leadership. We're watching and following Art, so thank you.